Are you serious, game? You did not let me jump. I was spamming the slide. They let me slide, but would not let me fucking jump. They made you crouch and shit. Now spamming the jump button too. Yeah, oh, fucking cheese it like so. Oh yeah, his shield just. Hey, look, another one of those things for doing something. This shit isn't so hard, is it? Just a bit weird. It's not necessarily hard. And it's not necessarily weird. It's just that it's frustrating how sometimes, like, because I know I'm running this on an emulator, so it's not going to be completely 100% accurate, right? But. Right. But when it comes to the core mechanics, fucking let me do the goddamn core mechanics. I would think sometimes, though, that if you're on a computer, they actually would have ironed out some of these issues. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, maybe you can buy the game on GOG, good old games, see if it's, like, available as a PC port there. Uh, I doubt it, though. Yeah, I doubt it. Old games like this don't tend to be part of the... They're abandoned wear, which is why they're emulated. Yeah. And if they're abandoned by the creators, I don't see what the problem is of emulating, uh, fucking games. Because if they're not going to be taken care of by the, uh, the people that made and created games that, that do get abandoned, fucking let someone else care for them. Oh, yeah. Let's see, so... Got five. Got three hidden ones. Actually, how many precursors? So, I'm missing quite a few of those still. Yeah, maybe there's more inside the fort. Maybe. Oh, look at all those. I'll go hit the boxes. Go get health. They're nice. We'll just whack that guy. jump on one of the things and start from there as a platform because you're able to do that before you know I mean on those yeah but then again are they even near anything oh what about those platforms to the right or are those just sticks <gasps> no platforms native sticks Platforms made of sticks, yeah. Sticks. I oh, you only need a few more. What even are these creatures? They're called lurkers. I don't know exactly what they're supposed to be based off of, but... They're pretty generic. 
So you gotta get that blue all the way down, right? Which would be... There we go. Which would not be that difficult. Well, the last of it should be on the uh, main building itself now, so that's good. And over there. And over there, yeah. Creaking? Okay, and I don't get it. What's that supposed to do? It, it's like a um, a checkpoint of sorts, so I don't have to go all the way around again. Oh, an elevator checkpoint. Gotcha. Okay. Are you getting on the roof? I'm trying to. I don't think I can jump that high though. Is it even worth it to get up there? Sounds like it is. Maybe that's just a log. Can you not hear the, uh, the scout fly? I do hear that buzzing. I think I heard that for a little bit. Maybe there's there no- Oh shit, there you go. I don't know what made that jump better than the other, but it worked. <laughs> Yeah. Well, you already know one of them is over there on the other side, so. You just gotta do all this parkour shit over here to get to it. And of course, a single jump suddenly would not work. What the fuck? That's icy. Yeah, I know. I don't like that. It's a, it's a do big I. dick developer move.
deactivate the percussion blockers. Okay, so it's... No. It was this one. So open the frozen crate and something else. What frozen crate? Did you see a frozen crate? Maybe it was somewhere made of ice. Like underneath that lake. Did you ever go underneath that lake? No, I didn't. I don't know how to. Well, there has to be some way. So you've done the fort now, yeah? Yeah. So that's where it came up. <laughs> there's something I still have to activate over there. Oh, there's a cube in the wall. Oh. You can't do that without that fucking fire vent, and you can't use that fire vent without activating something somehow. Well, uh, I can at least. Is there a lower ledge that you could have jumped to? I see. There's the ice. Yeah, here's the ice I need to get to. Yeah, you need to get down there. Okay, so that's closed off. So that's the only way in. How do you get over there? That's a great question. See, I saw, if you go back to that platform on that side, I saw a depression in the fucking ice, in the rock. Like, it could have been a cave opening. Or it was just stupid, you know, terrain design that makes you think it looks like that. And you said it was back here, right? Yeah, it was back there. What sort of chaos are you up to now? I'm trying to Many figure things. out a, a puzzle in Jack and Daxter. <laughs> no, not, not there. The other place. Hey, Reggie. Yeah. Guess what? Um, something good finally happened. I mean, does, like, getting yeeted by an electric scooter count as good? I suppose. Do you feel better I afterwards? Mean, I mean, I had a good laugh, and I persuaded the doctor to put a bruised ego on my discharge papers. Oh, sweet. Yeah. That ye. How is the yees? So, how did you get yeeted off a scooter? I was riding it, um, just riding home from work and hit a pothole. Oh, uh, fucking potholes. Yes. We're in a city full of potholes and potheads. There's pot everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. Well, potholes, potheads, and apparently there's a guy that's walking up and down the street by where I work, uh, jerking off at people. Oh boy. Fucking yeah. funny. Portland is amazing. <laughs> yeah. 
nothing else happen? Um, I moved into a really nice place. I have two insane kitties. Um, I'm loaded up on Oxycontin. Oh yeah, Oxycontin. Yeah. Um. 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 I had a cookie. Oh, I had two cookies. Nice. You had two cookies. I had two cookies. What kind of cookies? Big fucking chocolate chip ones, the size of my hand. Nice. And I know you've got big hands. Oh fuck yeah. <laughs> Because you're Reggie. We're calling them the you're... mini Reggie cookie. Huh? We're calling them mini Reggie cookies. Oh yeah, they're kind of small, aren't they? Yeah, if they're only the size of the palm of your hand. They're not as big as like the pizza size cookie. I was about to say, should I like, next time I like, have the like, extra funds and the Insanity to do so, send you like a freaking like pan cookie collection or something. Yes, cookies. <laughs> I still never got the first ones. Oh, the specialty ones? Yeah. Yeah. I'll have to gather you some then. Ye cookies. Yee, cookies, I will make you calm. Oh. <laughs> I like I mean, that. Unless you... Um, I mean, you don't want the, the specialty cookies with the specialty herbal supplements in them? I want all the cookies. <laughs> so just... It doesn't matter, just cookies. I could just send you a box of random cookies and you'd be like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Oh, I can't bring the flut flut with me. No, you cannot bring the flut flut with you. It is illegal. They put invisible barriers because they're assholes. That is so mean. They want to keep a good bird down. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Shit. So I literally just made a vice. Yep. That sucks. Hey, after you played this, uh, you guys should totally play Conquer's Bad Fur Day. Oh yeah, for sure. Mm. I've actually beaten that. Ah, yay. I should find other games. Uh, let's see, what other games exist? All of them. <laughs> All <laughs> of the games exist, yes. It's a very long list. Do we exclude mm -hmm. the bad ones? Yeah, we'll exclude the bad ones. They no longer exist. Gotcha. Except for the E.T. game. The E.T. game must exist. Alright, let's go to the landfill, Rusty. <laughs> Should be a copy there. Should be. Mm, maybe oh man, later. and now I'm like... coming up into another excuse to go down to California, and that's, um... this, you know, the Salton Sea? Yeah. Yeah, that place might be disappearing because they might be turning it into a silicon mine. Oh. So I need to go down and like look at the salt and sea before um before it no longer exists. Yeah. Sounds like a good goal. Yeah. And Rusty to explain the salt and sea, it's basically a sea with like such a high level of like saline and something else that anything that touches it dies. Really? So there's yeah, there's basically like these dead skeleton creatures um, that are like in crystal like encrusted with crystallized salt. That sounds awesome. Yeah, I mean, come on, who doesn't want to go walk on a beach that's basically just bones? Bone beach. That sounds good. Mm. Bone Beach could either be something very scary or something very pornographic, which could also count as scary depending on your feelings and things. Well, that's why you put ER at the end.
Hmm, let's see, what else can I report? <gasps> oh, speaking of things, there's a shop up the road for me now that specializes in, like, creepy stuff, and they have the most amazing, like, preserved animal skeletons. I guess Reggie isn't interested in preserved animal skeletons. No, someone sent me egg. Egg? Yeah, egg. Tell me of this egg. Uh. Is here, it eggy? Egg. It's very eggy. It's squirt egg. It is egg magnified. Yes. Egg. Egg. Fascinating egg. I have to send that to my other egg friend and watch them yes. scream at me for the next 20 minutes. <laughs> Reggie, what oh, I found? I have, a, res I have a response trees. egg. Egg. I might have a response. Because I had to see it, now you do too. God damn it. Ooh. But no, they actually have some really cool stuff in there. I mean, they actually have, um, like, penis bones. I'm sorry, so... what? Yeah. That's good. There are... Yeah, the picture or the penis bones? The bones. Both. Yeah, some animals actually still have a bone, you know, in them. That's actually quite fascinating. Yeah, it is kind of. Uh, oh, and uh, guys, fishy. Like a bitch huh? Just to let you know, I am streaming. Yeah, I noticed. Yeah. I was gonna say, but kind of sucks is like it's so expensive to send stuff up to Canada. Send it's expensive what up to Canada. send anything anywhere. Like if I like I could like I've been kind of slowly compiling like care packages to send to some of the people, and I was looking into like sending some stuff up like towards Canada because thankfully I have people that come into my workplace that ship to Canada, and it's like so expensive to send things. Uh, and like they're really, really being like super finicky over like any everything that crosses the border outside. I could send you a uh, penis bone and like some other random crap. Would be cool to get one of those from you. Yeah. Oh god, there's so much weird shit out there. Wasn't there orbs in here? Yeah, they were like on the way out from where you entered. You may have already grabbed them. I don't think I did because I entered from over here. Right, and that's like the only way through, right? Yeah. Because it was one way in, one way out. One way in. One I don't know, go down that slide. And that just leads me back outside. Huh. Maybe you already grabbed them. Mm. So is this new place more expensive or cheaper or just way nicer? Way nicer. Well, that's great to hear. Yeah. I mean, unfortunately, I've made one neighbor mad because the sound of my crutches in the hallway makes her angry and she yelled at me. But she can't do anything about it. Ah. So oh. That sounds like a her issue. Yeah. Yeah, that absolutely is. I mean, if it's like tile and the crutches don't have proper foam on the bottom. But like, no, it's honestly, carpet. 
it's carpet and what? I've got the squishies on there. It's just the the click and hop that I make doesn't sound good, I guess. Well fucking deal with it. And yeah. it's I don't I mean she can't do anything about it, so I think she's just gonna have to die mad. Yeah. Yeah, because that's that not... so shit. Yeah, because honestly, that's not fair on you because, like, even though you got hurt and whatnot, she should not be mad for something that you can't control. Yeah, well, I mean, I don't have to go, like, out of my way to bother her. I mean, she... The only reason, like, she even heard me in the first place is because, um... There's two elevators in the building that I'm aware of so far. And I'm next to one elevator, but the mail room is on the other side of the building. So I have to, right. you know, shimmy over there and hit the mail room. And then I have to, uh, and I don't really like to go through the garage. Oh, well, whatever. I also get to laugh at the bulletin board because apparently somebody's throwing away, uh, furniture in one of the trash bins and they basically just said we're gonna find out whoever who's throwing away the furniture and we're gonna fine you three hundred dollars per piece. Wow. Yeah. Okay, have you seen that um uh I think the game's called New Worlds, it's an MMO. Yeah, my out. friend Musket's been playing that a lot. Uh, yeah, I heard that it, like, will break some of the graphics cards, too. Oh, yeah, really? it will. If you have a 3090, it does not have a frame limiter. Fuck. The yeah, game does not right. have a, fr a frame limiter, so if you fucking try and do it without a uh, V-Sync and also make it so that your graphics card, uh, well, NVIDIA, in the control panel, you have to go through a certain step to make it so that your graphics card will never go above your fucking computer, fuck, computer's frame rate, like your uh, computer screen's yeah, frame rate. That is hilarious. Yeah, that's all because the people that are making it, apparently Amazon is the one that's making it, cannot program a fucking safe mode to it. I thought, like, it got sold off from Amazon to something else. I think, like, um... No, I think Amazon still owns it. At least from my understanding, they still own it. So it'll... Oh! Done. On, on the lines of dumb things, um... Microsoft is looking to buy Discord. Oh, great, so they oh. can turn into another Skype? Yeah, apparently. That's awful. I hope they... Don't fucking give in to Microsoft on this one. I hope so too. Because you know damn well that it's just gonna be another fucking Skype if it does. Yeah. Well, let's see what else, um, other things that are cool. Oh, on a less bullshit note, also, um, have either of you played Warframe? Uh, yeah, yeah I've, I've played, I played it with before. you at one point. Huh? We played with X Ray on Warframe at one point. Oh yeah. I haven't talked to X Ray in a bit. I have Horizon. Ago. Yeah, I'll have to drag yeah. him out because I need somebody to help me because I want to get the new Lolly frame. Oh, <laughs> I love that. It's a new, new Lolly frame. Mm. Excellent. Yes. Well, me and Reggie can both help you with that. Yay! Yeah, we. Should. We need to, like, start doing weird group crap again, because it's great. Yeah. It is great. Just having had a game, you know, that everyone would be playing or some shit, that, that's what happened. We haven't had a game in no time. We should totally play ARK and just talk about all the bullshit that is ARK. Just that bullshit Velociraptor. And that bullshit boss, and that bullshit radiation, and that bullshit whatever the fuck that is. And that's bullshit, right. and that's bullshit, <laughs> and that's cat, and that's bullshit. Yeah. There was a whole thing for Ark. There was a lot of stuff. There was also all of Worlds Adrift, too, and, you know. I don't know. Uh, 
got yeah, busy. I miss honestly. World of Drift suddenly. Yeah, I don't miss it. I'm looking forward to shit like. Um, well, that there's that Void Train game coming. Void Train is absolutely going to be a fucking blast. That is like hands down, Raft and World's Drift put together. What also is going to be like probably better than Void's Drift, even though I think Void's Drift is going to go um, co-op multiplayer connections through Steam, you know? Uh huh. So it's not going to be like a big MMO server, hopefully. You know, it could just be well, nonetheless. Playing. When each one comes out, I will totally get it so we can all play together. I am absolutely throwing money at Void Train. Ditto. Because, I mean, that game looks like so much fun and it looks just weird enough to play. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. Definitely, definitely group thing there. Void to drift. 